describe that Ramadan feeling. One of the things I think about is that that feeling of warmth, like everything just feels a lot warmer, and you can tell that on Ramadan, in Ramadan, because everyone's on the same mission, it's like everyone's united, isn't it? And you and and it feels so good, like. It's so amazing to see everyone trying to strive in that month. You feel like the mercy of Allah in that month, innit? What have you outgrown since last Ramadan? What have I outgrown? Yeah. Bro, I think, you know what? I think I've outgrown valuing money so much. Like, since last Ramadan, mm. this Ramadan, I've kind of valued experience more now. Like, I'm just trying to experience what Vibe. makes me happy. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Good vibes only. But before, it was the opposite, man. I was, like, trying to... Go for like places, jobs, whatever that I don't like just for the money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was not happy at all. And that money fell short. Okay. So, how can you incentivize a needed change in yourself? Uh, first things first, you took me away from the in- incentives. What did you call me? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what you called me. What is your ideal suhoor? Um, well, now it's my fourth. Uh, Ramadan, inshallah. Um, I realize I don't need to eat as much for myself, <laughs> so far because I, uh, I don't know, it fills me up differently. Um, bit of fruit, um, but yeah, that's kind of it because I eat kind of throughout the night, so um, that's kind of it, yeah. Zach, this one's for you, yeah? It's a challenge. Choose one social media app to delete for the rest of Ramadan. Instagram, easy. Instagram. Easy. Yeah, do it now. Are you ready? Just like that, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like that. Instagram's deleted. It's gone. So, uh, Faisal, describe your ideal Eid morning. A bit like this. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> no, but ideal Eid morning. Um, all right. There's decorations in the house, decorations in the house for the kids, gifts for the kids, um, loads of food. And in, in our culture, there's a food called, uh, people call it sevia or sevenya, like different, in different dialects. But it's basically like, I don't know, it's like milk noodles. <laughs> I don't know, that's the only way I can describe it. But it's like proper, it's nice, man. How do you, Kara, how do you say it? Semia. Semia, yeah. Bengalis call it semia. Yeah. Sweet. It's very sweet. It's like milky. It's like milky noodles, basically. But that that's that every Asian household that's a staple. Yeah. Do you and guys not have um, Seven Up and milk? Nah, what? I've heard some of the <laughs> Asians do. Yeah, they have Seven Up and milk. The Pakistani, Pakistanis have Seven Up and milk. <laughs> I didn't try it. Ramadan. I like, I like trying seven Up and milk. Yeah, Seven Up and milk is a big thing in Asian households, but I don't. I've never had it. How can you improve someone else's Ramadan? Um. Bringing them iftar. Definitely, I'll say. Improve it. You never know. Because, okay, the beginning of Ramadan, like mm-hmm. the first 10 days, the household's cooking with food. Yeah. Everything. <laughs> That's true. Stop on say. fire. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mums are active, you know. Yeah. You know, yeah. everyone's active. But it starts to slow yeah. down. It slows down yeah. a little bit. <laughs> towards the middle a little bit. Yeah. You know, the food's not. Sometimes they're eating the same food, maybe from yeah, yesterday. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? yeah. So, what I'll say is, maybe during the last, maybe like the, you know, half, halfway half through t- Ramadan. Half time thing. Yeah, to literally just cook up a nice little satam. What are you giving them though? What are you giving them? Bit of lasagna, okay. Okay. bit of chicken wings, barbecue. Okay. Mm. Yeah, bit of, um, 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 um. Mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Bit of sides, so I'll say with the sides, maybe some samosas. Yeah. yeah. And then maybe a nice flask, you know what a flask is? What, is that mm. Yeah, for what though? We printed like it. It's Vimto, Vimto milk. The know what the flask is anyway. Yeah, yeah that's watching. <laughs> yeah. And a nice flask, I'll say, of yeah. tea. Okay. Mm. Nice tea. Somali Kark. tea as well. Somali. Or maybe karak. You're getting better than it. Yeah. yeah. But Ooh. <laughs> I'm telling you. Or maybe even, if, if not that too much, but maybe just like everyone's got a signature dish in it. Yeah, yeah. Like me, I've got the barbecue wings. I make some nice barbecue wings. Inshallah. Mm.